A class memory book is a great memento for students and families to take away with them at the end of the school year. In today's episode of Easy Classroom Blogging, please subscribe, we are going to look at a super easy way to make one using everyone's favourite book creating app, Book Creator, and then share it to the blog, such as in this wonderful example from Amy who teaches Grade 2 here at the Western Academy of Beijing. First up, create a new book on Book Creator and choose a layout. I find that the landscape works best. Although, as you'll see in Amy's example, she used portrait. Next, add a title page with an image. A class photo makes for a great title page, but make sure the orientation of your class photo matches your book. Next, go through and add a page for each student, putting their name at the top. Leave the last page for yourself. For younger students, you might like to add a template for them to follow, or you could discuss as a class what each person will put on their page. If you're going to allow video, it is best to get them to keep it between, say, 15 and 30 seconds at the most, otherwise the size of the book is going to end up so large it might make sharing it difficult. The next step is to get the book template to the first student's iPad, the student who was on the first blank page. The easiest way is just airdrop it to them. The first student completes their page and airdrops it to their classmate on the next page and so on and so on until all the students are complete. The final student then airdrops the completed book back to you and you can finish off your page. To share the book with your students' families, you can upload it directly as an ebook if you're using easyblog.org. Or if your classroom blogging platform doesn't allow books to be uploaded, then you could export it as a video and embed it on your blog. So there you go, thanks for the look. Use your blog to share a memory book. If you found that little gem helpful, subscribe to our YouTube channel for lots more great tips on getting the most out of your classroom blogs. Find us on Twitter and Facebook and don't forget to visit easyblog.org now for your free classroom blog.